Android XR is here to revolutionize the way we interact with technology. With groundbreaking features like hand gestures, eye tracking, and AI integration, the future of immersive experiences is closer than ever. Android XR is our new platform for headsets and glasses. It offers some of the best tools for developers to use, and it reduces a lot of the friction. Imagine navigating through apps with just a glance, or controlling your device with simple hand gestures and voice commands. Android XR's multimodal input offers flexibility like never before, moving beyond the traditional touchscreen. Hey Gemini, what have I missed in the Besties group chat? Me and Sarah are discussing meeting later today at Geo's Pizza to celebrate Kelsey's promotion and are wondering if you can make it. Are there any vegan options there? Yes. Reviews rave about the mushroom penny pasta. Great. Tell the group I'll be there. Oh, and can you send the pic of the blue just to let them know what I'll be wearing tonight? How's this? Awesome. Send it. Is there a store where I can get a card for Kelsey nearby? Serendipity Cards is a good choice. Let's go. The AI assistant, Gemini, is a game changer. It's context aware and provides real-time information, making navigation and interaction smarter and seamless. Popular apps like Maps Photos and YouTube are being reimagined for three-dimensional environments. Picture walking through a city in Maps or reliving memories in a 360-degree photo gallery. Developers, this is for you. Android XR supports existing mobile apps while offering tools to create new XR experiences using familiar frameworks. Innovation just got easier. And here's the first device. Samsung's Project Muhan headset, set to launch in 2025. It's the perfect blend of Android XR's features and Samsung's innovation. From multimodal inputs to AI-driven experiences, Android XR is setting the stage for the next tech revolution. What excites you the most about this leap into the future? Comment below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe.